sportsnet.org.au. You're not the sort of bloke to ever will a horse not to win. But there was one horse deep down you really didn't want to win the Melbourne Cup. And this was in 2006 when the Japanese raider <laughs> Delta Blues won the Cup, ridden by Yasunari Iwata. That's right. And he couldn't speak, well, maybe he could speak two words of English, at best. That's about the best, John. We all go through our life with one thing we remember. Bill Collins said to me once, 34 Melbourne Cups. I said, Kingston Town can't win the Cox Plate. He said, I'll always be remembered for that. Um, me, I thought, well, there's no, no one thing that I... But then when that came along with the... Japanese jockey, and what had happened in the Caulfield Cup, Nash Rewilla had ridden Delta Blues and Damien Pop Rock. And now, I, I, never, I never ever rehearse an interview. I never ever can because I don't know what's going to win it. And so then all of a sudden you get thrown out of sync, you know, and I don't ever rehearse. I just, uh, at the spur of the moment, that was, is what I do. And I thought, oh, Nash, easy, you know. Damien, easy if, if the Japanese horses win it. Mm. A week before the race, they changed the rider on Delta Blues. Blues. And yeah. I thought, can this happen? Can it win the Melbourne Cup? It's got a Japanese jockey. Five interpreters he had at the races. He doesn't know a word of English. I don't know a word of Japanese. So we would go out on the track that day, and I said to the boys in the studio, I said, because I got communication with them, and I said, hey, fellas, I said, does anyone, in, anyone up there know any, just in case? Does anyone know any Japanese? And one of the guys, he's all get one always one in the back of the van. So oh, I know a couple of words, let's see in the in the Japanese vocabulary. I said, what are they? He said, uh, Konnichiwa and Sayonara. I said, what does that mean? He said, hello and goodbye. I said, what Neither order? Neither of which would apply Not after the, the Melbourne no. Cup. <laughs> no, but, I, but I, I never had a clue. And he said, I knew sushi of that because we ate a lot of it, you know. But, yeah. And then he, and I said, well, what order? And he said, don't know that. <laughs> and I thought, well, konnichiwa, sayonara. So anyway, they get into the straight, and, <clears throat> and I watched them go out the straight with the, the red, the gold and the black, and Damien and, 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 and uh, 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 Iwata were alongside each other. And when they get down, because Greg Miles and the boys in the, in the studio and that in the, in the, in the seven and the court rules, race course caller, Greg knew that... He'd heard like the conversation I didn't know, and, and I really feel in the back of his mind he was thinking of me because he said, Japan's going to fight out the Melbourne Cup. He said, they're head to head. He said, you know, Delta Blues is in front, Pop Rock's gone up. He said, Ollie's drawn the whip on Pop Rock. And I said, please hit him, Damien, please hit him. <laughs> you know, and they go over the line. And, of course, he said, yeah. Japan's won the Melbourne Cup. And I thought, please say Pop Rock. Mm. And he said, Delta Blues has hung on. I thought, no. I'm in trouble. I am in trouble here. They come round the corner, and of course, Damien hit Iwata on the back. And then Iwata, not knowing, you know, it's only this much, not knowing if he'd won or not, he comes along, and I come along, and of course, they did an interview in Japan. And I've got the microphone. And when I canned over on Banjo, I, I went over and I pulled up alongside Delta Blues, and I said, Winner. And he said, Winner. And I said, uh, uh, Happy. And I'm trying to get a bit of yeah. communication. He said, Happy, and then all of a sudden he said, "Super horse," and he took off. And I said to the boys, "He said, what are we going to do?" I said, "The world's watching." I said, "The interview's gone," and because the Sayonara and the Kanichiwa, you know, the other one, yeah, he was in the back, and he said, "Get hold of Damien Oliver." He ran second, asked him how unlucky he was, and I said, "I should go." So that was the shortest interview ever, John. It'll okay. never be forgotten. Very happy. Very happy. Biggest winner ever! Super horse! Super horse! Yes. Oh. And, you know, those sort of things, John, like you remember in your lifetime and, and and there's a lot of things that never ever leave you in your life. You know, some things that you feel you haven't achieved, hmm. some things, but I feel that that was one thing that, uh, that I'll always remember it anyway. I'll always remember hmm. that. Hey, Letty, 